Good evening, President Craighead, distinguished board members, Superintendent Dr. Baker, executive staff, and community. Greetings and salutations. My name is Korea Rankin, also known as Korea Mia Moore, and I'm a junior at Cabrillo High School, and in fact, their student body president. I'd like to start this off by giving a warm welcome to our new principal, Dr. Poffenberger, as well as congratulating Dr. Fulton Williams and Mr. John Meyer on their retirements. We appreciate your leadership and thank Dr. Williams specifically for his participation in the many graduation ceremonies over the course of his tenure with our Board of Education. I'd also like to personally thank our board members and executive staff for having me here to share with you all about the, what a wondrous impact Cabrillo High School staff and environment has had on us all. As you know, there has of course been a major change within the environment of school due to the ongoing pandemic. Students have lost motivation and as many may say, their second home. I am, fact, I am in fact one of the students who once felt this way. I completely felt lost. Like I was going down a deep dark hole which only got deeper and dimmer the farther we got into the year. I completely felt lost. And this is coming from the student body president, a student leader. So if I was so lost at the start, imagine the students who do not already have a path and goal set for them. I was able to find the light with the help of Cabrillo staff and of course my family. I would love to shine a light upon some of our staff who support so many of our students. Mrs. Smarlin, Ms. Granary, our ASB director, one of our English teachers, Ms. Montu, one of our law teachers, Mr. Newman, our visual and digital arts department lead, Ms. Godfrey, and our vice principal, Mrs. Alexander. I would not have felt this motivated and important without them showing you that this is our story. It only gets better from here. There are just a few of the caring and empowering staff we have at Cabrillo High School. Cabrillo isn't just a school to me. We are all a family. So much of a family that even though our campus is enormous, we can easily spot a new face that is in need to be welcomed. Though, now that the experience is virtual, we have yet to question if these new fellow Cabrillo students feel like they can call their school their second home. That is a topic ASB has been trying to figure out. And by doing so, we have organized multiple virtual activities, which allow students to still be engaged without being on campus. Our ASB Instagram page highlights the lovely photos of student participants, which allows the students who are following the page to meet new Cabrillo students and gain associates. Regardless of this pandemic, we're continuing to keep up the school spirit with safety precautions. We are making sure we lift our voices and social platforms to build a wider community, even outside of Cabrillo. Even with virtual learning, our school is also focused on increasing the number of students who meet A through G requirements. Our teachers, counselors, and administrators want to make sure that all Cabrillo students are college and career ready and have a choice of attending a two-year or four-year university. We have outstanding students who are making sure this time away from campus is used positively to build their reputation and future. For example, my fellow ASB JAG, Joy Wallace, and I are two out of the three finalists for this year's 2021 Group of the Year Award with the Boys and Girls Club of Long Beach. In fact, I won the scholarship competition this year and Joy had won the same scholarship last year. This allowed Cabrillo's name to be represented in the press telegram, not just once, but twice. We are proud to represent Cabrillo's student body and even more proud to give back to a school that has given us so much. We're definitely a school that is on a mission to build our image. I know a lot of people look at our sports and the neighborhoods surrounding our school and allow that opinion to dictate the quality of the school. That is wrong. And we are determined to prove that. Once again, thank you for having me here to share with you about the wondrous impact Cabrillo's high school staff and climate has had on us all. We truly are the success in the West. Thank you. Thank you, Korea. Um, I appreciate your honesty with us and I appreciate you letting us know that you've had a hard time with this online instruction. And can you share what kind of coping skills you've developed or what has helped you when, when you're feeling down? So honestly, I am very active into school. Like I've been in plays, I've been in the dance performances and like a lot of things on campus. So since I'm heavily active, once like the whole March 12th, I believe, we left campus, it was like really, really hard. And I was very depressed. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. And so with that being said, at the beginning, I was more to myself. I wasn't focused on school at all. Like yes not at all so with that um i had a lot of teachers that recognized that and they reached out to me so that was one of the things that really put me into school again and like made me want to run for president etc because i just felt that love and that care at cabrillo high school like 
our teachers deeply, deeply care about us. I know a lot of people probably can't say that. So I would just say the comforting and the welcoming um, of teachers reaching out to us and letting us know that they're there for us, it really helps me. Thank you for asking. Thank you for sharing. That is a wonderful shout out to our teachers and a, a great testament to Cabrillo High School. And I can tell you, you are so proud. Do we have other questions? I think um, Dr. Williams, did you have a question? Yes. Uh, well, I'm very proud of uh, this young lady and uh, what she's been able to accomplish. Uh, just wish you all the success going forward. Very proud of uh, the school. Uh, uh, a standard for me would be uh, the, just the amount of energy and effort we've put into Cabrillo quite a bit. Uh, and uh, I really admire that t-shirt that she has on. I'd like to get one of those. Uh, <laughs> Wonder, wonder why I can acquire one of those, Korea. Uh, very nice. Thank you. So we actually have a Cabrillo High School, on our Cabrillo High School website, there's a link to our ASB website, which is a different separate website. And we have all of our clothing and it's just a whole bunch of Jaguar and et cetera for our spirit wear. So you will find it on the Cabrillo High School page. Thank you for that. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you for asking. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And we understand that you may be busy with schoolwork, so we're not going to insist that you stay the whole entire meeting. If you need to go and take care of whatever you need to take care of, we understand, although you are welcome to spend the whole entire board meeting with us. <laughs> Thanks again for being here.